the topic today is are you beautiful of course for me <laughs> you are beautiful only beauty nothing else in you it all depends upon how you perceive things that comes from your culture friends so august rene rodin born on 12th november 1840 in paris died on 17 november 1917 in france was a french sculptor generally considered the founder of modern sculpture he was schooled traditionally and took a craftsman like approach to his work rodin possessed a unique ability to model a complex turbulent and deeply pocketed surface in clay He is known for such sculptures as the Thinker Monument of Balzac, the Kiss, the Burgers of Calais, and the Gates of Hell. Friends, August uh, Rodin said to the artist, "There is never anything ugly in nature." Hence, you have seen the nature. we try to destroy the nature to create money but the more we try to destroy nature and build concrete structures to put up heavy lightings colorful lightings to drag the flies towards the city they consider human beings as flies and of course when the samskriti when the culture is disconnected human beings people becomes flies they get attracted to lights to the fire and they get destroyed have you ever seen a nature nature never produce anything ugly yes and it cannot be ugly because the nature doesn't know what is ugly it only knows to love and bloom once you know to love and bloom you are beautiful who stops you from being beautiful the whole world will be behind you seeing your stunning beauty and even to use the word stunning beauty they may be connect you to sex and try to destroy you beauty is not even accepted you cannot even tell somebody that you are beautiful they may really think you are trying to penetrate them to have a sex such was the destruction of nature yes hence from time immemorial they say the father and mother never sees their children as ugly they think it's a gift of god and every part of their movement every part of their body is beautiful yes and they feed and protect and bring them up the only one thing is the child was sent to a stranger's place called a school or university to be corrupted to be brainwashed to go against the nature against the beauty against the parents hence the word in the dictionary came ugly otherwise anything everything was uh, beautiful yes such a beauty exist just look far away and you can see the sky you can see the mountains so beautiful but when you go near to that the moment human beings go near to it they dirty it up it is not that human beings were dirty it is the slave mind which has been imparted to them slave mind i remind you please look into slave mind through the books our education policy went wrong to create a slave trade yet universities were churning out slaves august rodin said to the artist there is never anything ugly in nature yes where there is ugliness when there is ugliness in your mind when you look at another person and try to dissect and segregate them then you can find ugliness when you do that you will always see poverty and 
poverty reflects back into you you become poverty you become poor hence even if when you have money you live poor the richest rich people are physically poor because they don't have health yes look into your prism and just enjoy the beauty i was having a satsang yesterday and i was asking my village people you eat food from your mouth and you make sure it is so tasty so beautifully presented artistically arranged so that you can have a beautiful tasty food but the food is the same when you go to the restroom you see the toilet do you think the toilet you come and put it into the plate no so when you are making such beautiful food for for you to have it in the mouth you should not talk ugly or dirty you should always think of beauty when you talk to others even if the other said comes with a different beauty which you think is ugly you should not change your car because it is said this car is petrol car and you will always make sure you put petrol if you put diesel the car will not run so your mouth is very important so it possesses the eye possesses everything is beautiful together we can wipe out more tears and bring down hunger you will be able to see truth and god and that was what everybody is running to the church to the temple to the masjid to find out what god listens yes there god cannot listen in that dark holes god listens to your sweat and when you sweat it out every day you are healthy in that health there is god friends auguste rene rodin said to the artist there is never anything ugly in nature you are beautiful and i love your beauty